Have you heard of the We Do Not Care Club? It was created by this absolutely delightful creator, Just Being Melanie. Look at like all of her different pairs of glasses. <laughs> this is blowing up. She has like over a million followers. And Melanie, I love what you're doing here. She's really tapping into the experience of perimenopause and menopause of like, we simply do not care. These are the things we don't care about anymore. And in honor of that awesomeness, we are going to talk about the brain reasons of why when you are in menopause, you simply do not care. Welcome back to Yay Menopause, where we reveal the superpowers that nobody is talking about that we get as menopausal women. Now remember in the last video when we talked about the three Ps, puberty, pregnancy, and perimenopause, where your brain goes through these really big changes and you have these symptoms like brain fog and temperature changes because of the reorganization of your brain, but your brain is getting ready for you to have superpowers. And one of those superpowers is neurologically that you simply do not care. Like you give less fucks. Your brain becomes less reactive to negative emotional stimulus. So if someone is upset or has an expectation of you or wants you to show up in a different way or is being rude or judgmental, earlier in life, your brain would have registered that stimulus as something that was way more of an emergency, like, oh, I've got to do something so that they feel better, or I've got to change myself. And the wonderful gift that we get as matriarchs is it just doesn't register as that big of a deal. We neurologically become more confident, less constrained, and we prioritize ourselves and what we need over what somebody else would want us to sacrifice in our boundaries or our standards to make them feel better. And you can find the book we're referencing in the series, The Menopause Brain, at our link. And I would love to hear from you. What are you letting go in this chapter of life? Like, what do you know no longer serves you? What do you not care about anymore? How are you really prioritizing your standards? And what are you not caring about in other people's demands?